Just another reaction with the toxic channel. Once again, we doing Jeff Dunham, a Vantru Loquist. I said it correctly, thank God. Anyway, before we move forward, I would like to speak about the store, guys. I hope you, you check it and buy purchase something from there, guys, as support for me. Out of this paradise, I'm talking syncopated, breathing, love every evening, going three, six, five. appreciate it and if you're enjoying the video that i'm making uh maybe send it with a super thank it motivate me to do more and send me more suggesting guys of you i really uh, i'm happy to do so so yeah let's just check it it's 36 minutes about jeff and his uh, basically about all the character here and then we choose which one we follow and we do more of him the funnier one we do more of him and some character, some character we already know about them, like this guy and like um, Ahmed. So the, so far I did these two, and we're gonna do more anyway. So this one it, uh, it involved uh, all the character in it, and let's just dive in, guys, and make sure to subscribe. This town is too freaking bizarre for me. Why do you say that? On my way in here tonight, I saw Aquaman on Hollywood Boulevard. <laughs> Oh, it's in Hello what Hollywood. <laughs> Why would Aquaman be on Hollywood Boulevard? Well, there's a drought. I guess he's homeless. Is <laughs> <laughs> it? You know, Walter, there are a lot of things to like about Los Angeles. Like what? Traffic from hell. Highest gas prices in the country. Wildfires. Mudslides and earthquakes. Yay! I love it here! <laughs> Dumb <laughs> You ever been in an earthquake? Uh, does my wife falling off of the couch count? <laughs> <laughs> what the f Oh, it's you. Right. Why are you in a bad mood already? Well, do you know what it's like to wake up and discover that your wife of 45 years has left and isn't coming back? No, I don't. Yeah, me neither. But I can dream, can't I? <laughs> this guy complain, really yeah. complain about his wife all the time. <laughs> his grand, grinchy grandpa. Yes. The other day, uh, all before her birthday, stuff. she started yelling at me. Tomorrow, I'd let her see a diamond. Oh, a diamond? What'd you do? I took her to a baseball game. So does your wife like Hollywood? Yeah, but she thinks it's crazy how many folks in this town get plastic surgery. Oh, she wouldn't do that? Why? Why not? Come on, putting new headlights on a minivan doesn't make it a Corvette. <laughs> <laughs> <He's searching. laughs> yeah, these guys know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and the women who get those fake giant hoo-haws, they don't want you to miss them either. How's that? If you look those women in the eye when you're talking to them, they, they get all pissed off and they go, hey, my boobs are down here. <laughs> I bet your wife likes at least a few things in LA. Like what? I don't know, the Kardashians are filmed here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I had those. I'm sorry, I threw up in my mouth a little. <laughs> Kardashians. Hey, who the hell's that new tall chick? She's kind of hot. Who's the tall? Did I miss something? Yeah, I think so. What the hell are you laughing at? Walter, that's Caitlyn. Who the hell is Caitlyn? Oh yeah, yeah. It's it's a it's a transgender. Oh, it's her father who became a, a woman. No. <laughs> it's her father became a woman. Yeah, I, I don't I, don't, I really don't follow them, but I just saw it on uh, TikTok passing by like this. They were speaking about it. What the hell's so funny? What is she available? No, I don't know. <laughs> like, well, what does your wife watch on TV? I don't care. Are you guys happy? Look at me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> we still love her. Yeah, of course. But like most marriages, we had been through some difficult times. Sure. But we stay together because of the children. Oh, you say your, your children saved your marriage. <laughs> yeah. Well, admittedly, a good marriage can be hard work. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know it can, yeah. We went to a marriage therapist one time. Just once? It was a therapist. You didn't like the therapist? Oh, no, he seemed like a good guy that after listening to my wife talk for 10 minutes, he jumped out the window. <laughs> Seriously, absolutely. And if it wasn't for the leash around my nuts, I would have followed the guy. <laughs> Look, Walt, I know for a fact that you love your family, you still love your wife, and I think that even at this age, every once in a while, you should still try and be romantic with your wife. Good Lord. <laughs> like how? I don't know, do you ever speak to your wife in a foreign language, like in French? Some women love that. I call her a French name now and then. Oh. <laughs> Mon chéri. Quasimodo. So is there romance between you two? Well, not long ago, my wife left a trail of rose petals on the floor for me. Oh, into the bedroom? Right out the front door. <laughs> you know, there are plenty of romantic places in this country you could go for a special time together. Like where? Top of the Empire State Building. Oh, no, we tried that. A security guard took one look at her and went, uh-oh, King Kong is back. <laughs> See, just like that, you've been married for over 45 years. Have you ever said anything to your wife that you truly regretted? Oh, yeah. Will you marry me? I love you. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, when your wife is in a romantic mood, do you ever think about taking one of those little pills? Cyanide? Oh, yeah, I do, actually. <laughs> Come on, what does your wife put on when she's feeling frisky at bedtime? Night vision goggles. <laughs> then she sneaks around the house and hunts night down. <laughs> it is scary stuff, my friends. <laughs> when was the last time you even put your arms around your wife? A couple of weeks ago when she was choking on a piece of steak. <laughs> you see there, he gave her the Heimlich. Yeah, I know, I was drunk. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> I was so close. Maybe you could do something simple, like watching a movie together. Oh, no. Every time we watch a movie, she falls asleep. Then the next morning, I have to drive back to the theater to pick her up and bring her home. <laughs> have you done anything fun in town here this week? You know I don't like getting out. Oh, you're a little bit of a hypochondriac. Yeah, why don't you wear one of those paper masks? Why, it's taped or it can't stop anything. I mean, hell, the Constitution is taped or it's never stopped our current administration. <laughs> Just trying to get a read on the crowd tonight. So I take it you're not exactly happy with our government right now? Are you kidding me? Congress's approval rating is at 12%. <laughs> Jokic has a higher rating than that. So you paying attention to the presidential candidates? Oh, yeah. How would you feel about a female president? Oh, fine with me. Just whoever it is, make sure it's after she hits an applause. <laughs> Walter. What? I was there when my wife went through it. She had been president then. Holy <laughs> I'm hot, I'm cold, I'm sweaty, I'm clammy. <laughs> you Russia launch the missiles! <laughs> you realize you just defended about half the room here? Yeah, and the other half is trying not to look at their wives and going, yeah, he's got a point. <laughs> <laughs> So you told me you've been getting on the computer a lot lately. Oh, yeah, and you get on Facebook. <laughs> what? You get on Facebook. Yeah, what do you do on Facebook? I like getting on there and defriending everybody possible. What? Why? Just so they'll wonder what the hell they did wrong. It's funny as hell. Well, what is that? What is that? I, don't, I didn't understand it. Defriending? I didn't catch it, though. I really didn't catch it. That's In not the nice. Comment, guys. No, if it was nice, it wouldn't be funny as hell. I did actually lose a friend on Facebook the other day without defriending him. How's that? Well, an old buddy line posted that his wife died. Oh, I clicked like. <laughs> then I posted mine still alive, sad face. <laughs> 
so you're getting into social networking. Yeah, a little bit. You know what I don't understand is why young couples today keep nude photos of themselves on their phones and then text into each other. What the hell? When I was young and dating my wife, I never thought she's so beautiful. I'm gonna marry her. The first thing I'm gonna send her is picture my balls. <laughs> <laughs> that was really dumb. What? People ask me all the time if my show is family friendly. What am I supposed to say now? It depends on your family. <laughs> What is well, since you've gone there, do you and your wife have a decent love life? Oh, she does things to mix it up now and then. Really? Yeah, she bought a pair of handcuffs. Really? Yeah. Like I need another reminder that I'm serving a life sentence. <laughs> handcuffs at our age. That's this like guy really hates his wife. <laughs> he's not happy. He looks like he's not happy. <laughs> Fifty shades of old and gray. <laughs> <laughs> So is there a good communication between you two? I guess. The other night she said, your lips say no, but your eyes say yes. What'd you say? I have glaucoma. <laughs> <laughs> so how's the actual love life? You mean sex? Yes. It's always doggy style. Walter. <laughs> yeah, she rolls over and plays. What doggy style is the best one? <laughs> Come on. Doggy style is the best one in the He's dead. <laughs> what the fuck is it? Yeah, she rolls over and plays dead. <laughs> that was and I just lick myself and go to sleep. Bro, you said it's a family show. <laughs> Walter, come on, good comedies and you can paint vivid pictures in everybody's heads. That was a then go. Yes, it was. Say goodnight, Walter. Thanks, everybody. That's all. Okay. <laughs> How you doing, Papa J? I'm doing pretty good. No, this one is a new one. Drunk or good? Okay, this one I don't. I I didn't check him before at all. The only character I check, I told you about them. This one is a new one for me. I didn't check it before at all. So let's just check him. But we're, let's, it's just as a reminder, guys. Make sure to check the store. I will leave you what we have in the store right now. And if you if you like if you enjoying the video so far, make sure to send it with a super thank. I really appreciate it, and it motivates me to do more. And if you have other suggestions, please be my guest. I would be happy to do so anyway. So what's been going on lately? Well, uh, last week I went to another NASCAR race and got hurt hammered. <laughs> <laughs> drunk again? Oh no, it's the same drunk. I just keep extending it. <laughs> Yeah, if you're not drinking at a NASCAR race, you're not at a NASCAR race. <laughs> Where are you? You're at golf. <laughs> and Bubba J, do you drink excessively? <laughs> Bubba G, Bubba G. I don't know what that word means. <laughs> What's the longest you've ever gone without a beer? How long have I been out here? Less than a minute. There you go. <laughs> do you know your drinking limits? Uh, daily or lifetime? How can you tell someone's lifetime limit on drinking beer? Well, if they die when they're drinking, that was it. <laughs> what I meant was, do you know how much beer you could have before you've had too much? <gasps> I could have too much beer? <laughs> sure, that would be fantastic. <laughs> you guys are cool. <laughs> have you ever drank as much as you wanted? Yeah, what happened? <laughs> you looked pretty. <laughs> <laughs> Can't you have fun without beer? Yeah, but why risk it? I don't know. <laughs> Would you rather drink beer out of a can, a bottle, or on tap? Oh, yes, yes, and yes. <laughs> Just remember, Bubba J, you should never drink alone. <laughs> You're not fooling anybody. That's why you have us. So your favorite time to drink is at sporting events? Oh, uh, yeah, sporting events, yeah, it's good, yeah. Do you drink beer every day? Uh, only on, like, days off. Oh, you don't have a job. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> every day? My favorite holiday to get drunk on is St. Patrick's Day. Oh. Oh! There's all the Germans! What?
this char this character I think uh, he is from the US. Yeah, obviously US, but it's like from the West. I don't know how it's called. The cowboy side? No. I think it's the cowboy side, like. Like we see in the movies, like uh, they drink too much and dirty as fuck. Hey, oh. Oh! Like we see in the movie, anyway. There's all the Germans! <laughs> right. <laughs> I didn't know you were Irish. I'm not. I also get drunk. Oh, he's Super Irish. Leo and Martin Luther okay, that was a mistake. He's, he's Irish. He's Irish. Luther King Day. And I'm they drink too much, also. Or black. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, sorry, 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 sorry. What? I don't want anybody thinking I'm racist. Why would anyone think you're racist? Because I said Mexican. <laughs> and I also said black. Sorry about that. Bubba Jay, it's okay to say Mexican and black. It is? Sure. Why? Because everybody here is white? No, it's just okay to use those words. Okay, well, thanks for keeping me real, Cracker. But I gotta do something about my gut. Are you gonna start working out? <laughs> oh, no, I'm gonna get a bigger shirt. <laughs> Somebody told me that to stay in shape, I should get a trainer. Yeah, that's a good idea. I did it. You did? Yeah, how's that going? Pretty good. So far, I can sit and shake and roll over. <laughs> and then I get a cookie. <laughs> so what else do you know about L.A.? Uh, the bad traffic here reminds me of marriage. How's that? You're stuck in it because there was an accident. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's saying like, he's taking it because it's an accident until they had sex and they had a baby, so now he need to stick with it. Anyway, <laughs> that's what he meant with. Walter told me to tell that one. That's a good one. <laughs> Here's another one Walter told me. You want to hear this? No. Getting married is like your iTunes agreement. How's that? You'll have no idea what you're saying yes to, but you'll agree just so it'll shut the hell up. <laughs> so you've been to Disneyland? Oh, I love Disneyland. Did you? Yeah. <laughs> Did you see It's a Small World? Is that the one where you go on a date and it turns out she's your cousin and you go, ooh, it's Lil' World? No, no, that. Been there, done that. <laughs> hey, did you know they now sell beer at Disneyland? I did know that. How old do you have to be to drink beer at Disneyland? Oh, and no, everything goes by height. Really well. So you got drunk at Disneyland? No, I stayed drunk at Disneyland. <laughs> Papa Jay, that's not good. I know, it was bad. At the arcade, I thought we were really hunting and I shot Donald Duck. <laughs> he had a big one in the suit. Now he walks a little goofy. <laughs> you get it? Goofy. <laughs> hey, did you know that here in LA last week, some guy tried to sell me a map to the stars? Oh, did you get it? No, I went, duh, buddy, just look up. So Baba J, when we're in Southern California... To be honest, this guy is, uh, is a funny character, this one he using. He's really a funny character. Are you ever worried about earthquakes? No, I'm used to it. The ground is always moving when you're hammered. <laughs> if it stops suddenly, that's when I fall down. No. <laughs> hey, do they have Walmarts in Los Angeles? Sure, you like Walmart. Oh, yeah. It's so convenient. Where else can you get Jesus left, kid? <laughs> Sorry, I screwed up the joke. It's <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Endlich kann dein Team seine Prozesse steuern, ohne zwischen unzähligen offenen Tests hin und her springen zu müssen. Mit Monday. Wait a minute, you screwed up the joke. <laughs> Don't make me say what I did, you did, and then make it your fault, my fault, my brain hurts now. <laughs> I'm too much drunk to, to think. Ask? No, what were you trying to make me ask? I didn't screw this up, you did. I may be dumb, but you're helping me.
All right. <laughs> you want to try that joke again? Huh? You want to want to try the joke again? You, you need from the start? Sure, just just to get it right. To redo the whole joke? Yeah. Uh, okay. 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 What's my first line? Hey, Mr. D, why are we on stage like this all the time? This is my job. What is this is? <gasps> to stand here and talk to everybody? That's right. That's your job? Yeah. <laughs> Don't exactly need a college education for this, do you? <laughs> I graduated from college. Oh, and now you do this? That's right. Well, that's a big choice of money, wasn't it? <laughs> you need more education to boil an egg than you do this. <laughs> hey, can you boil an egg? Yeah, well, there, there you go. You got something to fall back on. <laughs> hey, I forgot to tell you, Walter told me I should get on Titter. On what? Twitter. Oh, well, that doesn't sound as fun, does it? <laughs> hey, you know what the hardest part is about the internet for me? What, remembering all the passwords? Well, we'll keep it simple. Just use the name of someone you love. <gasps> My dog? Sure. What's your dog's name? Dog? <laughs> your dog's name is Dog. Actually, it's Doug, but the U is silent. <laughs> it's Italian. Papa Jay, have you tweeted? Oh, yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> now, how it work? How it work now? Uh, when you when you tweet something, how are you gonna say? Uh, I tweet. I tweeted or I exit? <laughs> I don't know how you're gonna say it. It's now it's a become big an X. I didn't know you know. <laughs> I usually blame that on dog. Hey, somebody told me they saw me on the internet. Oh, have you Googled yourself? <laughs> Not in public. <laughs> Not a lot. Okay. I can still see. So I take it you grew up in a small town? Yeah, pretty small. How small? Well, we didn't have a street light, so the hooker stood under a flashlight. <laughs> I called her Everetti. <laughs> you know, Walter and I were talking about our government. Yeah, do you pay attention to politics? Oh, yeah, pay attention to yeah, politics. Yeah, sure do. Okay. <laughs> okay I, can I ask you your opinion on some current issues? Oh, yeah, current issues. Okay. Let's talk about some things you might be familiar with. Okay, for example, Bubba J, what is your feeling on gun control? Oh, I know this one. <laughs> guy's dumb. Oh, yeah, if you're drunk and seeing double, shoot in the middle. <laughs> so what do you think about taxing the 1%? Oh, I don't know. I drink whole milk. <laughs> Are you familiar with the term no child left behind? I think the movie's actually called Home Alone. <laughs> so what do you think about immigration reform? Is it bad for me to say I'm kind of on the fence on this one? <laughs> All right, what do you think about the Clintons? My wife says I can never find it. Now this one, I didn't get it. Do you know what I heard the other day? I heard that some folks get something... This one is a new character. What well, I don't know what's her name. He's gonna say it anyway. Yeah, it's just a small reminder, guys. Uh, every, every after every character, I just remind you guys make sure to check the store, guys. I really appreciate if you purchase something from there. Subscribe if you enjoyed the, the reaction that I'm uh, making, and send it with a super thank if you. Uh, I, it really motivates me to do more. So, thank you guys, and let's dive in. 
something called a coffee enema. I don't know what that is. I don't want to know what that is. And please don't let it ever show up on the menu at Starbucks. <laughs> on the other hand, if you really want to pull an awesome joke when you're standing in line, secretly write it on the chalkboard menu. <laughs> then you get to the register, point to it and say, last time I had that one frozen. <laughs> it gave my butt the shivers. <laughs> I'm gonna open my own coffee place. This could be a whole new line of beverages for me. The Cafe Boutte. <laughs> the espresso. <laughs> the Crappuccino. <laughs> the best part of waking up is coffee in your butt. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. How long you been like this? Yes! <laughs> so you're addicted to caffeine. Duh, 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 duh. Is there any way you can get off it? I tried to attach, that didn't work. Why? I stuck it on my arm, took it off my arm, rolled it up, snoped it, yay! <laughs> and then I tried some kind of gum, but that didn't work, gum. Cause I got it mixed up with a condom and that was a big <laughs> bubble I blew right there. <laughs> you lost a shoe? No dude, I found one. <laughs> <laughs> to see on TV. I'm a professional. <laughs> Sorry, just kind of got away from me there. Sorry, Peanut. Her name is Peanut. Stand up. Come on, stand up. You're fine. Close your mouth. Close your mouth! Apparently they can understand you and I can't. <laughs> can you close your mouth? What? Wow. The hand. What the hand? Yeah. Whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> oh, you want me to close your mouth? Yeah, hold on now, okay. <laughs> What? What? What is you do? So far this peanut character is not really funny to me. It's not a funny character anyway. It's, it's funny. It, for me it's not funny. To be honest, Ahmed, I don't understand why people <laughs> like you. Oh. Yeah, this is my favorite. I don't know why. That's easy. Why? If folks had to pick between Justin Bieber, Kim Kardashian, and a dead terrorist, I win that contest hands down. <laughs> Thank you, I kill you, thank you, I kill you, thank you, I kill you. All right, so as a terrorist, excuse me? I said, as a terrorist, do you think just because I look like this, this automatically makes me a terrorist? You just said you were a terrorist. No, I didn't. Are you crazy? Yeah, a little bit, what? <laughs> Ahmed, that's another thing. You always say my name incorrectly. It's not Ahmed, it's Ahmed. 
It's so frustrating. The only folks who get any need are their Jewish guys and heavy smokers. <laughs> but the best is a Jewish heavy smoker. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so is there an English equivalent for the name Ahmed? Yes. What's that? Larry. <laughs> it's not funny! Silence! I kill you! <laughs> <laughs> This stuff, yeah. I got made fun of a lot in school for that name. What school? Suicide Bomber School. <laughs> and ironically, we were in District C4. So how many teachers did you have? Technically just one, but we went through a lot of substitutes. <laughs> and what were the substitutes like? A little nervous. And always young. Yeah, that's another thing. Like, why are suicide bombers always young? What, you want us to use old guys that are already almost dead? <laughs> Son of a female goat. <laughs> I never thought of that. <laughs> Hurry this crap up. I have to go make a phone call. <laughs> so, Ahmed, why do you wear a turbine? Turban. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, Jeff, a turbine. <laughs> wow, the SAT was a bitch, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I wear a turbine because it's more powerful than a jet pack. <laughs> hey, oh, do you know what Donald Trump and I have in common? <laughs> What's that? We never let anyone see the real tops of our heads. <laughs> <laughs> well, what does it mean, this one? I didn't get it. This one, it, it went above. I didn't, really didn't get it. You know what Donald Trump and I have in common? <laughs> What's that? We never let anyone see the real tops of our heads. <laughs> okay, I didn't get it. What is that thing on his head? Oh! If you ever meet him, you should make it talk. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, with a Mexican accent. <laughs> So what do you think of Donald Trump? I actually love the guy, but you think I'm crazy? That guy's bonkers. <laughs> Even the ISIS guys are like, what the hell, dude, calm down. <laughs> so I understand you flew in today? Yes. On a commercial airline? Yes. No problems? Like what? You know, you know the TSA, the uh, x-ray machine. You idiot. For you, it's an x-ray. For me, it's a selfie. So are you enjoying your time here? Oh, very much. I get recognized a lot in Hollywood. I was out in front of the theater today signing autographs. Huh, they thought I was an Olsen twin. <laughs> 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 oh, screw you, that's a funny joke. <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me, did you know I have been adding to my career skills lately? Doing what? I am now not just a dead terrorist, I am a dead cyber terrorist. <laughs> A cyber terrorist. Don't forget to like me on Facebook. <laughs> you know, Ackerman, maybe for a different line of work, you could do something that would help people. Like what? I could answer a suicide hotline. <laughs> I'd be like, no, no, you're fine. Go ahead. You're good. <laughs> yeah. That's horrible. They're laughing. Not my fault. <laughs> So if you're going to be a cyber terrorist, do you have a new catchphrase besides I kill you? Oh, yes. This is a good one. It's going to scare the crap out of you. <clears throat> I click you. <laughs> Why are they laughing? <laughs> because cyber terrorist makes you sound like a nerd. <gasps> Being a cyber terrorist is not easy. It takes balls. Not real ones. What are you looking at, you pervert? <laughs> the hell? Yes, they're gone. I lost them in the explosion. Bye bye balls. <laughs> but I found them again. Yeah. Balls don't bounce. <laughs> there they are. <laughs> and, and, and you kept them. Dude, you don't just throw away your own nuts. <laughs> How the hell would that work? Hello, Salvation Army. Have I got something for you? And what'd you do with them? Well, I didn't make a keychain or something like that. Or 
hide it under my pillow and wait for the ball fairy. <laughs> wait, is there such a thing? <laughs> How much could I get from the ball fairy? <laughs> it's a matching set. <laughs> In the original wrapper. Oh, man. Oh, okay, don't ask me how I carry them. <laughs> I have a ball boy, all right. <laughs> you don't have them with you. No, no, they're at home in my junk drawer. <laughs> <laughs> so, Ahmed, what does a cyber terrorist actually do? As I said before, no more killing. You never have killed anyone. Silence! I delete you! <laughs> Woo! Is that my new phrase? Wait a minute, how do you delete someone? It's not as easy as you think. You first have to highlight them backstage. <laughs> but explain what a cyber terrorist actually does. I terrorize thy computer. Okay, but what do you think the best weapon you have is to make computers not work? Windows Vista? <laughs> do you send spam? You idiot, no pork. Oh. <laughs> what? That one's for all my Jewish friends out there. Yay! Oh, he's, he's, he's Jewish. Or what? Have you spread any viruses? Well, before the explosion, I had a little itch, but it went away. <laughs> if you're a cyber terrorist, who's your biggest enemy now? The CIA? The FBI? Siri? <laughs> I asked her to search the web for booby traps, and she said, I found a number of hooters near you. Do not worry, I will never blow up anything if I don't have my lucky charm, which I lost. You had a lucky charm? Yeah, what was it? I had a little camel's toe. <laughs> the hell are they laughing at? What? I had a little camel toe! You used to look at it all the time. I'm not kidding, he would rub it for good luck. Seriously? Can we sell little fake ones online? <laughs> Ahmed's lucky camel toe makes a great stocking stuffer! <laughs> you think anybody saw that? <laughs> <laughs> Where is it? It's on, it's on the floor. Get it, you idiot! Get my freaking arm! Go get my arm! Okay, no way! What? Don't leave me here, I'll fall down. Go with me, okay? Whoa! Okay, put it back. Okay, cut this is too thick. Okay, sorry, I don't know how to cheat construction. <laughs> All right, fine, there. Uh, it's not funny. <laughs> I kill you from here. <laughs> how would you do that? Just throw me. <laughs> Why not? You did peanut. <laughs> Rufen Sie Bernard die Türklingelkamerafirma an und kündigen Sie das Abonnement. Diese brandneue. Binat is not a funny character at all. Can you put it back? I think. I don't know what's wrong. Just put it back. You are so cute. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I think it's good. Is it okay? Oops, sorry. Don't touch my leg. It's not funny. Don't touch it. I can do this myself. No! It's not funny! Start laughing! Start laughing at me! Ah! This is not funny at all! This is all your fault! I kill you again! What? I can do this! Don't touch my leg! I still got it. <laughs> Don't let me fall down, what the hell? 
You want me to fix? Yes, fix my leg. Don't touch my wee wee. You don't have one. It's a phantom wee wee. His name is Robert. Unless it's really cold, then it's Bob. And don't make it talk. I won't. Funny at all, okay. But I think we're good. All right. So now. <laughs> what the hell? How can I be naked? I feel naked. Fix all this. I'm going to bite you to death. <laughs> it's not funny. Not funny one bit. This one won't stay. I don't know where. Take it out, I can feel that. <laughs> Wanna call it quits? I think so. You guys have been absolutely fantastic. Thank you, and good night. Yeah, that was really funny, especially Walter and the last one. Uh, Bobby G also was funny, <laughs> the drunk. Yeah, so that was the reaction for today, guys. Uh, if I don't do it in one, uh, in one part i will do it to two parts i will split it to two parts i hope you enjoy it and uh if you have other suggestions please send it to me i would be happy to do so to do the reaction guys check the store what we have i will leave you what we have right now Out of this paradise, i'm talking If you like and you enjoy and make sure to subscribe and if you enjoy the reaction that I'm, where I'm doing send it with a super tank I really appreciate it and it motivates me to do more and see you for the reaction peace